Last year, UNAIDS data showed that 160,000 children were newly infected with HIV. That's crazy. In 2023, no children should be infected with HIV. We have great science that allows us to start women on treatment that can prevent that vertical transmission, that transmission from the mother to her child. We also have fairly high antenatal care coverage throughout the world. And that means that women who are going in to get care during their pregnancy can be tested for HIV and started on treatment to avoid that onward transmission. We also see that about 50% of all of those new child infections occur in six countries. So if we focus in in this alliance, make sure that we're reaching those countries that have the largest number of new child infections, we can help them to ensure their programs are as solid as possible. They're reaching the women, they're getting them on the right regimens, they're reducing that number of new child infections so that at the global level we can end new child infections. Among the 160,000 new infections, we estimate that about 50% occur during breastfeeding. So new infections can occur during the pregnancy, during the delivery, and during breastfeeding. And so what's so critical to this whole prevention process is to make sure that women are supported to stay on treatment during that pregnancy as well as the full duration of breastfeeding. That way we can really reduce that number of new child infections.